for this party, proper headgear is a prerequisite. Would y'all like a wacky hat to count down the New Year's? Yeah. After a visit to the hat maker, the party got started. The New Year's Eve celebration is part of the dog days of December at HealthWorks. Each day was themed around education and exercise. Everything we have here basically goes over um, if you're going to eat woe foods or a high calorie drink, how much exercise is really going to take to burn off those calories that you're taking in. For today's exercise session, one of the youngsters set up an obstacle course in the Zoom room. All right, Mark, get set, go! Go, Mark, go! <laughs> they even let me have a go at it. Balance beam. Whoa. I can never hula hoop. How many times? Five. Five? Are you ready? Count for me. One, two. <laughs> Participants said the New Year's Eve celebration was a highlight of their Christmas break. Are you ready to go back to school? No. <laughs> you just want to stay here and do the obstacle course, huh? Yes. <laughs> What's the hardest part of the obstacle course? Hula hoop. <laughs> I agree. Now tell us why it's important to uh, exercise and have fun while you do it. To be healthy. What's that you're wearing on your head? Wacky hat. Do you like your wacky hat? Yes. Is it fun to wear it? Yes. Does it make you run faster? Yes. For nearly three years now, HealthWorks has provided a fun, interactive place where kids and adults can learn all about nutrition and healthy lifestyles and even get a wacky hat. It's all part of an effort by community leaders to make North Mississippi the healthiest area in the state. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.